Hi, I'm Mark for eTax.com. Wisconsin has a state income tax that ranges from 4.4% to 7.65%. This range is broken up into four tax brackets. Tax returns are due by April 15th or the next business day if that date falls on a weekend or holiday. An earned income tax credit is offered to Wisconsin residents. If you have qualifying children and are a working family, then this tax credit may apply to you. The amount of the benefit is determined by the household income and number of dependent children. Wisconsin typically taxes pensions and annuities at the same amount that is taxable by federal taxes. Social Security benefits are not taxed by the state. If you are retired and have an income of less than $10,000 or $19,000 for married couples filing jointly, then you may be eligible for the Working Families Credit, which eliminates the Wisconsin state income tax. This credit is only available to residents of Wisconsin. If you're retired and 65 years or older, you may be able to exclude $5,000 of qualified retirement income, including distributions from IRAs, from your taxable income. This is dependent on some income restrictions. Your federal adjusted gross income must be below $15,000 if you are a single filer or $30,000 if you are married, even if you decide to file separately. You are a resident of the state if you maintain a domicile in Wisconsin even if you are not physically present within the state or live in another state. A domicile is considered a place where a person intends to return to whenever they are away. It can also be referred to as a legal residence. You may live in one state and still maintain a domicile in another. You may only have one domicile at a time. Your domicile can be dependent on many factors, including such things as where you are registered to vote, where your vehicles are registered, where you live or where you own or rent property. For more information, visit etax.com.